meeting in uh, Munich this year um, is in an academic setting, which we didn't have in the past few years, and which is sort of coming back to the roots of the uh, ESDR, because the ESDR really is an academic organization that's focused on research, basic and translational research. And I think it's very, very nice to be back in an academic setting. Uh, it's a very modern um, venue with a lot of light and uh, lots of possibilities for interaction. We have tried to increase um, the possibilities for interaction um, by having a large poster um, exhibition and by also including electronic uh, poster walks. We've increased the number of poster walks significantly uh, in order to get people to inter interact more. Yeah, so it is one of our major focuses to help the young people to advance. We identified um, different groups of young people. We have the trainees uh, that are pursuing their PhD studies or postdoctoral studies. And then we have the group of people who are trying to become independent researchers. And uh, both groups, we try to give special support. Uh, we have started programs such as the Future Leaders Program, um, where those that are trying to uh, be independent get also some career advice outside of the pure scientific content. The meeting highlights are always the poster sessions. I think the poster session is the core of the ESDR meeting. But of course also we like to celebrate the invited guest speakers uh, that uh, often bring in uh, new technology and uh, very interesting perspectives, sometimes from outside dermatology, so that uh, it, it helps the community to think outside the box and to pursue new avenues. So next year, next year we will increase the interactivity even more. We are thinking of, of new ways um, to get people together that wouldn't necessarily meet uh, through the usual um, ways of interacting during meetings. Um, also, we are working on the internationality of the society. Um, we think that uh, the meeting next year in Salzburg will be attractive, uh, certainly for uh, also uh, researchers, dermatology researchers, out of, uh, outside of Europe, uh, for example, Asia. We like to attract as many as possible. So for someone who is going to attend next year's meeting, there will be ample opportunity uh, to interact with young people from all over the world, basically. Mm -hmm.